Welcome to the city of Long Beach, one of the most diverse cities in Southern California. Known for its long, wide beaches, the Queen Mary, Aquarium of the Pacific, and maybe what it's most famous for, Snoop Dogg. With so much drama in the LBC, it's kind of hard being in Snoop D-O-double-G. My name is Ian, and I'm going to take you on a brief tour of the history of Long Beach and things you can do. Long Beach is located just south of Los Angeles and surrounds the independent city of Signal Hill. It is in between many cities such as San Pedro, Seal Beach, and Compton. In the more recent years, Long Beach was a ranching community around the late 1800s. In 1885, competition between the new Santa Fe Railroad and older Southern Pacific Railroad attracted hordes of visitors to Long Beach and created a real estate boom. In 1902, the Pacific Electric Trolley was created in Long Beach, making the city the fastest growing city in the U.S. through 1910, creating hordes of visitors to the seaside and people seeking employment in the booming town. In 1911, the city created the Port of Long Beach, what is still the largest economic engine today. The port employs over 316,000 people and generates around $100 billion in trade each year. One of the biggest events in Long Beach's history was the discovery of oil in 1921. Drillers struck oil in Signal Hill and the surrounding areas of Long Beach. The discovery of oil allowed Long Beach to flourish. Even though Signal Hill is its own city, since it is surrounded by Long Beach, most people now consider it part of the city. Oil strikes in Long Beach and other areas along the coast make Long Beach one of the top oil producers in the United States. Long Beach also had an important part in World War II, as the U.S. Naval Shipyard Dry Dock was built to service the largest naval ships on Terminal Island. Also, the Douglas Aircraft Company plant at the Long Beach Airport would build around 4,300 of the total 11,000 C-47s built during the war. In 1947, the first and only flight of Howard Hughes's Spruce Goose, the world's largest airplane, took off over Long Beach Harbor. After the flight, the enormous flying boat is housed in its dry dock hangar, where it is stored in perfect condition for the next 33 years. In 1967, the city of Long Beach purchased the Queen Mary, which will be docked in the Long Beach Harbor as a hotel and tourism attraction. Long Beach also hosted the 1984 Los Angeles Olympics as well as the Long Beach Grand Prix, which has been held annually since 1975. The Aquarium of the Pacific is an amazing place to visit with all different types of wildlife, which was created in 1998, creating an increase in tourism for the city. Other notable features of Long Beach is our most famous ambassador, Snoop Dogg, who lived in Long Beach and went to Poly High School in the heart of the city. Some other important and fun things to do in Long Beach is, of course, go visit the beach. There's also the downtown and shoreline where most of the activities are. This includes the Pike, Shoreline Village, the Aquarium, the Queen Mary, and much more. Right down the street, you can go to Belmont Shore and 2nd Street. You can also head down to El Dorado Park, one of the biggest parks in Los Angeles. They have a skate park, barbecues for grilling, archery, and many more things to do there. Even though Long Beach is one of the largest cities in Los Angeles, it still has that small city feel. I hope you enjoyed this video on the history of Long Beach and hope you can come visit soon.